With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. In the question it is given that using the properties of determinant, we have to show that determinant of x, x square, y, z, y, y square, z, x and z, z square, x, y is equal to x minus y multiplied by y minus z multiplied by z minus x multiplied by x y plus y z plus z x okay so using determinant property we need to prove that this particular lhs value is equal to rhs value that means the determinant of this is equals to this value so first of all we'll be finding out determinant of this so determinant of this will be equal to we have x x square y z y y square z x and we have z z square x y okay so we need to find out determinant of this so first of all we'll be applying the property in the rule or applying applying the property of the determinant in the row this will be applying r1 will be equal to r1 minus r3 r2 and in r2 we'll apply r2 minus r3 okay so in the row r1 that is this particular row we'll apply r1 minus r2 at this particular row we'll apply r2 minus r3 so applying this this will become this will be equal to determinant will be equal to r1 minus r2 that is x minus y this will be x minus y x square minus y square and if we take z common over here so z common this will be y minus x now we have to do r2 minus r3 okay so this will be y minus z y square minus z square and if we take x common over here this will be x common z minus y and the r3 will remain same so z z square and x y so the row 3 has remained same okay now what we'll do is in this particular matrix we'll take we'll take x minus y and y minus z common x minus y and and y minus z common from from row 1 and 2 from row 1 and row 2 okay taking this common determinant will be equal to x minus y multiplied by y minus z then we have a matrix over here so we left with inside the matrix we will left with 1 x plus y minus z then over here we'll be have 1 y plus z minus x and over here in the row 3 will remain same to so z z square x y okay so this will be equal to this now what we'll do is what we'll do is in we apply row 1 will be equal to row 1 minus row 2 applying applying the property in row 1 this will be row 1 will be equal to row 1 minus row 2 okay so now what we'll get this determinant will be equal to this x minus y will be same this y minus z is also over here so matrix will become r1 minus r2 so this will be 1 minus 1 that will be 0 this will become x minus z this will become x minus z again r2 will be same so 1 y plus z minus x and r3 will also remain same z z square x y okay so this is the new matrix with this because we have applied r1 equals to r1 minus r2 now what we'll do is we'll take z minus x common from this taking z minus x common taking taking z minus x common common okay from from r1 so the determinant will now be equal to x minus y y minus z and z minus x right so this will become inside the matrix we'll be having zero we have taken z minus x common this will be minus 1 here also we have taken z minus x common this will be minus 1 and rest everything will be same we have y plus z over here minus x over here z over here z square and x y okay so now what we'll do is we'll expand this particular matrix expanding expanding along along row one okay so we'll expand this particular matrix along row one so the determinant will become these three values will be as it is okay so this will be x minus y multiplied by y minus z multiplied by z minus x right so 
when we we will take this particular value everything will become zero so need not to take the value of zero so we will take the value of minus one this will be minus of minus one multiplied by this will be if we hide this particular row and hide this particular column this will be one into x y that will be x y minus 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 plus this will be plus x z so plus x z okay now this will be minus one so minus one multiplied by if we hide this particular column and this particular row this will be z square z square minus this will be z into y plus z that will be z y this will be z into z and we have minus sign over here so this will be minus z square okay so this z square will be cancelled by this z square so we are left with we are left with the value this will be x minus y into y minus z into z minus x multiplied by if we solve this this will be minus minus plus this will become x y plus x z okay we have a bracket over here now this we have a minus sign over here minus of minus z y right so this minus sign will get cancelled so we left with x minus y into y minus z into z minus x multiplied by x y plus x z this minus minus will become plus to so plus z y okay so this we need to find out that is the lhs has come out to be equal to rhs that x minus y into y minus z into z minus x into x y plus y z plus z x is the determinant of the given matrix so we have just now find out this to be true so this is the answer of the question for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today